Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can set up your boom arm set. You can take your audio quality to a whole new level. It's actually surprisingly really quick and really easy to do and has the best payoff ever. It takes your audio from like amateur to professional. It's like amazing. So the first thing that you're gonna need to do is number one, clean your desk. Oh, sorry, all the guys out there with the messy desks. <laughs> that was me, I had to clean my desk before I even did this video. But make sure you're starting out with a clean and fresh desk. Kind of like when you're modding Skyrim, you need to like, like freshly reinstall that game. It needs to be super clean. You can't like install mods on an already expired modded game. You need a clean desk that you can actually firstly, your mental health feel fine and also have the space for your boom arm and deciding where you want to place it. The second thing that's most important is that your goal is to get the microphone as close to your mouth as possible while being as comfortable as possible. Because if you're streaming for hours, you don't want to be moving around so much. If you're recording a video, you don't want to be stressing about where you're going to sit. You just want it to be as easy to use as possible. Like literally sit down, extend your microphone, start talking, start live streaming, start recording, end it, and just push it away that easy the second thing you need to know with the c-clamp is you're going to need around four centimeters which equates to about 1.5 inches of space underneath your desk so that you can actually comfortably attach the boom arm so already now if you have difficulties with the desk and it's not going from the desk that's when i highly recommend getting the desk standing boom arm like the road psa which i super highly recommend if you have the cash to just kind of be like make it rain so you've checked and you have enough space now what you want to do is you want to actually attach that c-clamp part to the desk and then once that is attached you're just going to kind of slip your boom arm in then you want to do a test you want to extend the boom arm and retract the boom arm and just make sure that the boom arm doesn't actually fall out just that it's comfortable to kind of bring in bring out bring in bring out the next step which is super simple is adding the usb microphone or microphone that you have now for me personally i have the hyper x quadcast so if you have an hyper x quadcast it's actually i didn't even need to change any adapters but most usb microphones will come with an adapter to actually attach to the boom arm so just check the box there and just make sure that you have an adapter in case you need it for the specific boom arm but yeah don't stress about that most microphones and boom arms will come with adapters so that your microphone can easily attach to it so once it's attached you're going to want to also make sure that the front of your microphone is facing your mouth so what i needed to actually do is i need to detach it from the shock mount then i needed to turn it and reattach it to the shock mount so that it was facing me just so just since that was how i was positioning my boom arm once your microphone is actually securely attached to the boom arm what you want to do is actually attach the cable and you can even wrap the cable around the boom arm and some boom arms like the road psa even come with a with a bit of a gap for you to run the cable inside the boom arm so you can just check whether your boom arm has that feature but there's so many hacks and how to actually hide the cable so you can check this out but i simply just i just wrap mine around keep it out of frame and i'm happy with that does the job i can extend it i can retract it and it's super comfortable super convenient and super easy now quickly i want to answer a few questions so this is the fact question that stands for faq i'm not swearing <laughs> and it's a uh, first question what boom arm do i use well i'm from south africa so i have a very generic boom arm it doesn't even have a name it's just like that one the cheapest one i could find and it does amazingly so please stop stressing about boom arms and buying super expensive ones will my mic fit the boom arm yeah probably most microphones come with adapters anyways just in case what boom arm do i recommend well the one that you can afford but again if you really want to be like look at me people the road psa it's like amazing what boom arm do i recommend for heavy duty microphones the t20 boom arm it is freaking insane that thing can carry a tank in the form of a usb microphone <clears throat> if you're still not convinced on grabbing yourself a boom arm i highly recommend that you check out the video on my mic stand versus the boom arm at where i compare the quality of the audio from the two and that video will actually help you make an educated decision on whether a boom arm upgrade is for you so i'll see you guys there so peace